Hey, how you doing? If you're new here, welcome. If you're already subscribed, welcome back. And if you are new here, we upload new food content videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. All right, well, I heard that the KFC's got a new saucy chicken sandwich. So I'm gonna go ahead over there and pick one up. Now they do come, you could get different sauces on there. I'm gonna get the uh, honey barbecue one because I like that sauce. So we're gonna head on over to old Harlan Sanders place, grab us up a kick and sandwich, find a place to park it, and then I'll uh, review it, see what I think. You know, give you my ideas and opinions of the sandwich. All right, okay, let's head on over to old Harlan Sanders place. All righty. Here we are, old Harlan Sanders place. All right. All right, guys, let me run in there, grab my uh, order, my sandwich. We'll find a place to park it and we'll get into this thing. For the love of Pete. All right, everybody, we found a place to park it. <clears throat> and please, if you enjoy this video and if you've watched other videos and enjoy those, please hit that subscribe button down there if you haven't already. It's free helps out the channel we'd greatly appreciate it thank you guys for all your support we appreciate everyone all right well we got this sandwich unfortunately they don't give receipts over there at this kfc when you order online and by the way this offer for these uh saucy uh chicken sandwiches digital exclusive you gotta order it in the app you can't walk in and order one so like I said, I got the honey barbecue uh, chicken sandwich. And the price of that here in Rhode Island, I don't, you know, I don't know where it is. I, you know, I don't know how much it is where you live. Could be uh, $3, could be $30. I, I don't know. I'm just telling you what it is in Rhode Island, for Pete's sake. $6.49. And, of course, Uncle Sammy got to get the $0.52 cents and the TX. So this chicken sandwich, seven dollars and one penny. All right. Hope everybody's had. Hope everybody had a good weekend. You know, I did. Hope everybody is safe and you know you're nice and cool. It's been a real heat wave everywhere. But I hope everybody's doing all right. We got the handy dandy steering wheel tray, which can be found. At Anywhere on the old interwebs. All right, let's get into this. You know, I don't think I've ever had a chicken sandwich from KFC. Maybe, I, I don't know. Off the top of my head, I have no idea. Whew. Let me know in the comments, have you guys had this chicken sandwich yet? Saucy chicken sandwich. Which all right. And I don't see any they didn't give me any napkins, of course. I'm always prepared. I know that slack is over there at these fast food places. Well, let me give you a saucy sandwich, but no napkins. <laughs> You're not gonna be needing those. I'm not gonna need napkins when you give me a saucy chicken sandwich. That sounds suspicious. That's suspicious. All right, I got it all set up here. Let me bring you guys in. You can hook your peepers on it. See what you think. Check it out. All right. The bun seems to be really nice and fresh. Better than that one we got over at the Burger World the other day. Look like you've been sitting under a heat lamp for three weeks. There you go. Oh, wow. Jeez. Could they... Are you serious? That's like one bite of sauce. Oh, three pickles. Are you serious? Oh, all right. I was like, wait a minute. I was about ready to leave a real stern review on the KFC over there on Reservoir Ave in Cranston. That's where I got this from, but there's a lot more sauce on the bottom. Whew, thank God. Looks like they even toasted the bum. So that bum's a little toasted. Three pickles. 
Ooh, I was almost about to uh, be furious over here. All right, let me put you guys back up on the dash. Get into this thing. All right, let's get into this thing. Boy, did they hide that sauce. Ooh, I was about to be all upset. All right. <laughs> I mean, it looks good. Yeah, I don't believe I've ever had a KFC uh, chicken sandwich, but... Salute! What's the matter with you? Mmm. Not bad at all. And of course, to wash it down, you're going to have blue masa. Now, I believe you can get these in three different flavors. The honey barbecue, just honey, and the Korean barbecue. It's like a spicy kind of, a spicy kind of sauce. Don't forget, everyone, stay till the end. I'll give you my score and, you know, my final thoughts of what I thought of it. Yeah. The pickle adds a nice little, nice little taste to it. Now, this is a limited time only. Um, limited time only offer. Let me give you guys a look inside this chicken sandwich. Yeah. I mean, it's KFC. <laughs> It's KFC. Of course, the chicken's gonna be good. Mm. Mm. I love their barbecue sauce over there. Well, like I said, you can get it in three different flavors. Pretty good, though. That's a pretty good, hefty, big sandwich. It's not bad even, you know, just the uh, piece that was sticking out of the sandwich. Mm-hmm. Mm. Very good. They put so much chicken on there, it's falling out of the sandwich. You could just, you know, eat it as a little treat itself. I know next time if I get one, you can get me some dipping sauce on the side, buddy. That's a pretty good sandwich. <laughs> All right, everyone, let me just get this mess cleaned up and I'll be right back with my uh, final thoughts on my score. I'll be right back. All right, everyone, we get that mess cleaned up. Let me just stop by saying that. That's a good sandwich. Um, the bun the bun was very good. It looked like they toasted the top bun on it. But it was good. That chicken is absolutely delicious. I think it could use a little bit more herbs and spices on it, but it was good. It's like a crispy chicken sandwich. Uh, yeah, yeah. The pickles tasted fresh. I think there could have been uh, more sauce, definitely. I'm gonna, Next time, I have, if I get it, I'll have to get uh, extra sauce on the side so I can put as much on there and make as much of a mess as I want to make. That's what I'm saying. As far as the price... Mm, I think it was a decent price, seven bucks with the tax. That's a that was a pretty good size sandwich, very good size sandwich for seven bucks. So I think the value is there. I think it's a good price. As far as the sandwich itself, I'm gonna give it about a about a seven. It just seemed too bland. There wasn't that much, you know, when you get KFC chicken. You know, usually you get you can taste all the herbs and spices, but I mean, I don't know. That one just tasted bland, and there wasn't enough sauce on it. So I would say about a seven. Other than that, it was a good sandwich. I mean, you guys will let me know in the comments down there. I know you'll let me know what you think. You think seven bucks is good for that sandwich? Seems all right. It was a good sandwich. I enjoyed it. Could have been a lot more tasteful, you know. A lot more taste is what it needed. A lot more herbs and spices. But not bad. 
All right, it is getting late. As always, I got things to do, places to go, people to see. And um, today's Tuesday. I'll see you guys on Thursday for the next food review. We do them every week. Brand new food content every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the videos. We really enjoy all your feedback, the thumbs up. You know, leave a comment. We love it. Let us know what you like, you don't like. You know, give us your point of view. And we've been loving all the suggestions you guys have been uh, leaving to try different places. But some of the places I just can't get to because we just ain't got them in this state. Even if you go one state over, they don't have them. Some, you know, it is what it is. I can do what I can do for you guys. But I'm glad you're enjoying the videos. I'm going to get out of here. I'll see you guys on Thursday for the next food review. And as always, have a blessed day. I'll see you guys Thursday. Bye.